All right, YouTube family, we are driving home from the mountains from the race. Well, the, the race that didn't happen, but we're driving down I-70. It's a little crazy out here. They're shooting uh, cannons off along I-70 to bring the avalanches down just to keep everyone safe. So it's nice and slow going in the traffic today, but it's beautiful out. Look at look at these shots. I mean, the mountains are just covered with snow today. It's just absolutely amazing. But I have to pivot for the vlog today. The goal was to give you a nice, solid, detailed race report from America's Uphill, but it didn't happen. Therefore, we're going to pivot to the 10,000 subscriber running shoe giveaway, giving away four, that's right, four free pairs of running shoes back to you in thanksgiving and gratitude for pushing us over 10,000. So I'm just, it just blows me away. So thank you so much. So st stay tuned. We're going to get back home, uh, celebrate a birthday. That's right. It's someone's birthday today. And then give you the details on how we're going to give away these running shoes for all. Uh, well, I wish for all of you, maybe someday, maybe someday, but for four of you, four free running shoes. All right, let's get going. Come on. Almost home, cruising down I-70, and I just realized this as uh, just chilling out, thinking about life. Basically, even though we were unable to race, uh, Joseph and I, it was a victory, even though we didn't race because we stayed healthy this first part of the training block in 2019. Staying healthy is a victory. Like, if you're pushing your body and you're working hard, if you can stay consistent and healthy, that is for endurance training and endurance sports, you know like that is the ticket for getting better uh, for really any distance, but especially long distance running. So I'm chalking this trip up as a as definitely a victory. You know, it's I, I remember Joseph and I, we were drinking the beer last night and I was like, that was our victory beer, uh, even though we didn't race, but listen, we stayed healthy. So good news. All right, we're almost home. Can't wait to see Michael give him a big uh, hug and a kiss because yes he is turning one today That was basically Michael's first sugar, like real solid sugar rush. It's his birthday. He's turning of... one today, yeah. so he got his he got his own brownie and he crushed it. All right, I'm off to. I don't know about you, but my personality, if I don't clean the car like immediately after a trip, it could be a good month. It'll be a good month before it happens. So that's where I'm off to now. Clean the car real quick, then check the PO box. And then we'll get into the studio and I will explain to you the situation and how we're going to get out these shoes to all of you that enter the drawing. Enter the drawing. All right. On where we go. What an incredible journey we not just me, but we have been on here on this YouTube channel in the last six months. And yes, I tried to run 100 miles. The 100 miles didn't work out. It didn't work out as you saw in the footage, but maybe it was meant to be because guess what? That longer distance was kind of put on the back burner after that race and led me to 
this shoe in a 10K time trial. That's right, the Nike Vaporfly 4% Fly Knits I think has led many of you to this channel, which I'm grateful for. But I don't just run in Nike, I also run in the Big Bad Wolves. So for all you mountain and ultra running folks, you know, you know who you are. The Solomon Speedcross 5s, oh, what a great shoe. One of my favorite shoes. And yes, they have taken me up a couple of mountains. And very recently, very recently, we had the idea to give back to those who could not afford new running shoes. And so your generosity okay. what made this box happen. is that? You know what color box that is. Oh my goodness. Oh my, I have no clue. I have no clue. Brand new Nike shoes. What size will they be? Oh, you guys are the best. And so now, because of your dedication it, through that, through the comments, through the views, through sharing these videos, through hitting the subscribe button, and yes, even through sending gently used running shoes to the P.O. Box, I must give back. I must give back because I, I love you guys and I know that you're striving in your own little way to, to make your mark in the world, whether it's in your career, in your family, in your running, and uh, I'm just so excited that we have found each other here on the digital continent here on YouTube to share inspiration motivation challenges and yes running shoes so here's how here's how it's gonna go down I committed three weeks ago to purchase four brand new pairs of running shoes to give away to some of you out there I wish I could buy every one of you a pair of new running shoes but that maybe down the road you never know you never know but for now Four pairs of used running, of brand new running shoes. Two pairs are gonna go to two people, anyone, all right? And then the other two pairs are gonna go to high schoolers. So, one of the pairs is gonna go to a guy and the other pair to a lady in high school. All right, let me explain. Tonight, March 11th, if you're watching this, Monday, March 11th, you better believe it, we're doing another live stream, 7 p.m. Mountain Time, 7 p.m. Mountain Time, here in the studio, where we're gonna do another giveaway, okay? So here's how it's gonna go down. If you're a high schooler, today, by 5 p.m. my time, 5 p.m. Mountain Time, you have to email me if you really need running shoes, all right? Like, you cannot, like, I've gotten so many difficult emails. Okay, I shouldn't say so many. I've gotten probably eight very challenging emails from high schoolers who have been running in the same shoe for two years. Two years. And they just can't afford new running shoes. And so if you're in high school, again, 5 p.m. Mountain Time, email me a short little uh, paragraph about your story as to why you need new running shoes, why you can't really afford new running shoes, and I'll put your name in the bucket. One for the guys, one for the ladies, all right? So that'll be going down 7 p.m. Mountain Time. And then, here's the other deal. You're gonna have at 7.05, 7.05 p.m., I'm gonna open up the entry in the chat, and you don't have to give your shoe size, just give your name, every name, uh, it's gonna be like it's. I, I haven't. It's either gonna be three minutes or five minutes. I don't know yet. So from 7:05 to 7:10 p.m., you gotta get your name in the chat, and then we will write your names down. Shoe size doesn't matter for this because uh, we will communicate via email, and uh, basically all the, these shoes will be purchased most likely through Running Warehouse. I will be buying them for you. I will even help you decide what shoes to buy if you're kind of up in the air and you just, you have no clue like what type of shoe you might need. Um, I'll do my best, of course, and uh, we will go from there. All right, so 7 p.m. live stream, Monday, March 11th, and it's gonna be a very short window to put your name in, and this live stream will be much shorter than usual, probably like 
20 minutes, maybe 30 minutes at the most. All right, so we won't take too much of your time tonight live on YouTube. Does that sound good? All right, keyword, give, key, I think we've already done that keyword, but we're doing it again because I wanna just give back to some of you out there in gratitude for helping this channel get to 10,000 and just like, it's just a nice little milestone uh, to hit. It's just a nice little milestone. So the question of the day, here we go. What is the highest mileage you've ever taken a running shoe uh, to? For me, it was just two years ago. Remember the Hoka Claytons? I think I took them to 550 and they're a Hoka shoe. That's a, that's a lot of miles for a Hoka shoe. Uh, so what is the highest mileage? And this is in connection to the giveaway and like just trying to support those that, you know, can't always afford brand new running shoes. All right, that's the deal. See you tonight, 7 p.m. Mountain Times. That sound good? And uh, it's gonna be fun. So thank you again and onward and upward. How's that sound? Let's just keep going. Let's just keep going. Mm, 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 mm. Seek beauty, work hard, and love each other. See you tomorrow. Mm. See you tonight. See you tonight. See you tonight.